Bachelor of Science in Development Communication. Probably this is one of the college courses that sounds unfamiliar to most of us. And if you're one of those people who are curious about this course, I'm here to share with you my understanding about development communication. So what is DEVCOM? The concept of development communication is about communicating and relaying information to marginalized community in order to achieve development. It is a social science that uses scientific methods, researches, and identifying theories and principles that can be used to solve different development problems in a community. It is a people-centered field where they want individuals or group of people to change for better. Through interacting, influencing, and educating them, DevCom can help the people to change in a positive way and become a better citizens of their community. But why people-centered? It is because DevCom believes that we, the people, are the true measure of development. Some people think that DevCom is mass communication. But actually, development communication is not mass communication alone. Although DevCom uses the same media platform as mass communication, the purpose of DevCom for using this is different from how mass communication uses the media. It is because DevCom practitioners use media to raise public awareness in relation to community development. Besides from mass communication, we also have other allied fields of DevCom. I think it is very important for you to know the difference and similarities of DevCom to its allied fields. And if you're curious about that, kindly post this video once the chart appeared on your screen. So development communication has five areas of practice. Community communication. Practitioners in this area facilitate decision-making, problem-solving, conflict resolution, interest articulation, advocacy, and social mobilization in a community. Community development broadcasting is where practitioners plan, write, and produce radio and TV programs in order to communicate to their audience. Development journalism, which involves practitioners who are skilled in reporting and presenting news and issues through the use of print media. Educational communication. It involves practitioners who are concerned with the entire process of learning. They implement, evaluate, and manage solutions to problems related to human learning. Science communication, which focuses on bringing innovation to society. Practitioners in this area have a working knowledge in library science and information technology. To be honest, before entering this course, I really don't have any idea about what this course is all about. But now being a first year development communication student, I finally realized that I really do have potential in this field. I want to be an advocate of change and raise awareness to marginalized people about different societal issues in their community to help them achieve development. I also want to use media as my channel to empower people and motivate them to participate on social change. Make it short, I want to be someone who uses communication with development purpose. And that is development communication.